Okay, this is what we're going to do. Replacing the sway bar link bushings, we're going to replace the pivot, I'm sorry, the um, radius arm bushings, and we're going to replace the pivot bushings. If we can see those. There, it's kind of, you can tell it's all cattywampus. Um, so what we've done is we've taken the sway bar off taking the coil springs out, taking the shocks off, have everything hanging here. I got it on the lift about three or four feet up. Um, and what I plan on doing is taking some ratchet straps just for super safety, ratchet straps between the uh, knuckle and I'll just strap it onto the shock tower. And I'm gonna lift the truck a little bit higher and then I'm gonna get some, take a couple of those big jack stands and put them underneath and that should give me enough sag and I also be able to stand underneath the truck and use the impact to get these damn bolts off the pivots. Um, I got a couple bushings here. These are the K8292. They didn't have two Master Pros or two Moogs so I got one of each. They're identical. Um, and I also took off all the parts here and have everything uh, treated with some rust bullet yeah. and uh, gr ground them all down. I also painted the springs red. We'll see how long that lasts. Um, and I've got some spacers for the for the coils to give me an extra two inches so that way it'll level off because I put those new big leaf springs in the back. Um, Everything should be good to go. It's just going to take me some time and I'm probably going to have to beat on those bolts pretty hard to get them out of the pivots and also use the ball joint press to pull the bushings out and push in the new ones. So here we go.